Harry Ellis, one of your favorite Mr. Jayhawks? Um, well, yeah, he is. Uh, uh, they're all my favorites. So, so uh, yeah, but Perry, he, he's, I believe Perry won it last year too, didn't he? And so, uh, yeah, he's, he's very deserving and, and uh, you know, it's, it's so good to see uh, somebody that could have probably opted to go and uh, come back and better better his not only his, his uh, stock in this place but his stock uh, moving forward. So uh, really happy for Pete. What does Carlton's news do for you? Well, you know I've actually known that for about two weeks, but but uh, I never we haven't been in a situation and he hasn't told me for sure that he wanted to do anything. And then, you know I told him the banquet would be a perfect opportunity. And I mean I'm, I'm obviously I was not on my game tonight, but. I mean, he, I, gave, I, I threw him a softball. He could, he could, he could, all he had to do was just come up and take the mic and say, Coach, relax, I'm coming back. And I told him that's what he should do. Instead, he announced it from his chair. So, uh, 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 but uh, he, uh, I, I think, I think, it, I mean, we're, we're, we're set. We, we haven't got any letter of intent back yet, so we can't obviously comment on it. But, but uh, uh, I feel really good about, you know, who we're going to sign this spring and, and uh, I think we, we put ourselves in a real favorable position. With the conversations you usually have with these guys contemplating the draft, how, do, how does that change with the new combine rules this year? Does it change the way you go about giving them advice or kind of trying yeah, to steer I, them in I, 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 think, I think if a guy thinks that he can go and then he wants to make a commitment to go and, and, and test, then he should do it. But if a guy is telling you, I know I got to come back a year, then then I don't understand why you need to be tested, told told what you already know. And and uh, uh, you know, Brandon and Wayne totally different. They needed they needed to do what they did. And uh, uh, Sheck too. I totally agree with Sheck's move for him personally. Uh, and Carlton, you know. He, he knows that if he can get a little stronger and he can be a guy he average 12 to 15 next year, uh, he won't have to make a decision if he comes or goes. He's, he's going. And I think Steve's the exact same way. What's Jamari's plan this summer? Is he going to uh, uh, anything with Well, Jamari's interviewing agents, and uh, he will uh, hopefully get into some camp or summer league team. Uh, but if not, he'll sign with an agent that, that is, uh, that is uh, uh, someone that is equally good uh, across seas and, and finding a job overseas. But I think his first choice would be, hey, if I can just get on the summer league team or, or hang out for a little bit just to see what I can do, I'll do that. But, but I, I look at Jamari probably realistically playing overseas next year. What about Wayne? Uh, I think Wayne. I think Wayne will make it. I, I, I do. I think that. I think he's put himself in position, and he's so confident right now uh, that he'll go into uh, the combine uh, uh, healthy, fresh, and uh, with a chance to improve on himself. You know, people saw Wayne play at a very elite level this year. Uh, you know that. Kentucky, best competition, highest stakes, pressure, and, and to see what he did. So I, I think that there's, uh, you know, people feel good about him. They want to see more consistency. He gave them that for the most part. And so uh, uh, I think I, I, I like his chances. Knowing what you have coming back and coming in, is there something you really like about next year's team when all the pieces will be in place? Well, it seems like, well, it depends on, to me, the, the big key. We, we'll miss who we lost, don't get me wrong. But will we have anybody that will be able to kind of fill in for Perry? Uh, you can make a case that, that uh, we could be better at several spots if guys get better over the summer. And then, uh, uh, and if, uh, you know, Svee and LeGero keep developing. And, and, uh, and, but the big key, I think, is Carlton and Svee. I think if those guys take another step, I think it, it puts us in a position to, to uh, uh, you know, who knows who will be the best teams next year, but I think we got a chance to be one of them.